You know who this is really gonna annoy y'all. <laughs> and I hate to tell you. Well, I hate to tell you, Whoopi, you're gonna be annoyed by a secondary camera pointed right at you in a few minutes. See, so, yeah, while Whoopi stares right down the lens of the ABC studio camera in front of her to read the teleprompter during the view, Whoopi was kind of seeing double today. You know, I will say this, and I think it'll surprise people. You can see Whoopi have a moment of, oh, am I gonna have to go deal with this? <laughs> um, the fact Hold that on, his bond. Hold on. Sir. What's I have to I have to stop you with the camera because oh. I can see you. So do me a favor, <laughs> don't pull it out again. Yeah, just beyond the TV studio camera, she sees another lens up there in the audience. Yeah, being held by an audience member. I'd appreciate She's that. Great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What was he doing? Recording. Oh. Yeah, so I guess the guy forgot that The View is live on TV every day, and uh, he could easily use his PVR to record this. And much better cameras, too. <laughs> but yeah, The View audience is allowed to hold on to their phones, but strict policy of, like, keep them off and keep them in your bags, like, out of sight the whole time. If that wasn't the case, I mean, people would be filming every single commercial break, and you know they'd easily twist something to be like, you know, oh, look at what we did to that crew member, or Joyce, look at her cue cards during the commercial break. Yeah, they'd make it into something, so I'm not surprised that they have that no-phone policy at The View. Yeah. That doesn't count when it's been fair and legal. It's not normal. After handling that bit of business, we'll be still ways in on the hot topic at hand. But then you can tell, at least I can tell, her eyes going to the executive producer and the floor director who are clearly trying to communicate something to her. It's no, different. but it, what, what, how it just affected me. I'm going to get to her. My God, guys, <laughs> I'm going to get to her. May I finish my point or you want me to just jump now? Whoopi is not in the mood today. I'm not. <laughs> for your shenanigans. Not. Joy is happy it's not Friday today. You know, Ryan's I'm trying to do everything everybody wants, but, you know, I, I never mind. Go ahead, son. <laughs> I have a legal note, everyone. No kidding. <laughs> I think Whoopi would agree that she's often in kind of like a half slumber on The View, but oh, you have fired her up right now. And has pleaded not guilty Duh. to all 88 charges. <laughs> 88. So we needed to do that because y'all weren't aware that we just said it was 88 <laughs> charges. The reason for the legal note is not to repeat the 88 charges so the audience hears it, no. It's because uh, The View is considered a news program, so you have to have some, um, you know, presentation of being fair and balanced to both political parties. So yeah, that's why I have to put that legal note in to kind of like put the counter argument or the other side's perspective, so to speak. So yeah, and you know that Whoopi. You didn't know he didn't even say, no, I'm not. But Whoopi was just feeling feisty. And it's nice to see everyone saw Whoopi get feisty. So what are your thoughts on all of that that was interrupting Whoopi's view today?